food always puts me in a good mood. But did you know that there are specific foods that have proven mood boosting benefits? So you can eat to feel happier. Count me into that. Celebrity nutritionist Karina Heinrich and her two sons join us now. Karina, seeing you and your family automatically makes me happy. Don't worry, be happy. Hi, I'm Landon. Hi, I'm Austin. And I'm Karina, and we are so excited to be here today to show you how easy it is to incorporate foods that may already be in your fridge with proven mood-boosting benefits that can help you feel happier and less stressed. Yes, please. We're gonna walk you through these foods and an easy way to remember them is to teach you the Karina Method's high, low, lean, no nutritional rules, which is my signature method for optimal nutrition. Okay, Landon, so let's start off with the highs of my high, low, lean, no. These are high fiber and clean carb foods. Yes, Landon, so you wanna think veggies, fruits, easy to digest grains, one to two cups of berries a day have been shown to possibly help elevate your mood and lower your risk of depression. So easy to add to smoothies. I love bananas. I do too, Austin. And bananas may actually help turn a frown upside down. And did you know that if you eat a banana a few hours before bed, it can help with a better night's sleep, which makes us all happy. Okay, we love clean carbs like oats, leafy greens, oranges, all happy mood boosters. Next comes the lows in our high, low, lean nose. Healthy fats. Yes, your body needs healthy fats, but in low appropriate amounts. So you wanna think things like flaxseed, walnuts, and salmon. They're all super high in omega-3 fatty acids and can actually help boost happy endorphins that have been linked to lower levels of depression. A four ounce serving of salmon provides over 2,000 milligrams of EPA and DHA. So eating this fish a few times per week is a great way to get those happy fats into your diet. Okay, Austin, what comes next? I love chicken. Oh, I know you love chicken. So yes, our leans, our lean protein. So you wanna think chicken, turkey, eggs, beans, and lentils. Lean proteins are extremely rich in amino acids, which may positively affect your mood. Eggs are extra special because the yolk is also high in vitamin D known as the sunshine vitamin. So one to two full eggs a day may be able to do the trick. Okay, we've covered our high, low leans. So what do we have left? The nose. The nose. I have bad news, but I also have some really great news. So sugar. Sugar may give you a little happy boost at first, but research has suggested that too much sugar can possibly functionally change your brain and actually slow it down. But the good news is that the amazing exception is dark chocolate, which you know I love. Chocolate may significantly improve mood. You still should stick to around one to two small squares and make sure it has at least 70% cacao counts, which is the number you see on the front of the chocolate bar. The higher the number, the darker the chocolate. All right, Landon and Austin, let's share one of my favorite recipes that combines some of these happy foods, the Karina Method Dairy-Free Gluten-Free Pancakes, which is our crowd pleaser. Yum. Yum. In a large bowl, you're gonna wanna mix your ripe bananas, egg, vanilla extract, and unsweetened almond milk until it's all smooth. In a separate bowl, whisk together the flour, cinnamon, nutmeg, salt, and baking powder. Add in the first bowl of dry ingredients to the second bowl of wet ingredients and mix lightly until just combined. Over medium heat, lightly coat a large non-stick skillet with coconut or my new favorite, avocado oil. Pour batter using a 1 4th cup onto the skillet and spread out lightly with the spoon. Immediately add carobs or our favorite dairy-free chocolate chips to each pancake. Cook around two minutes until it bubbles on top, then flip the pancake and cook for another minute and a half until it's golden brown. This recipe makes eight delicious pancakes, and we like to double up on the recipe, freeze a bag full of pancakes, pop into the toaster, 
or a great on-the-go snack. You can add nut butter or top it with fruit or extra chocolate chips like my boys like to do. So happiness really does start in the kitchen. Even incorporating a few of these proven happy foods that we've covered today into your meals may have a significant positive mood boosting effect. And we could definitely all use some happy feelings right about now. Thanks for joining the Heinrichs today. Bye guys. Ooh, I love adding chocolate chips to pancakes. Those looked delicious. For more recipe ideas from Karina, visit her website, thekarinamethod.com. And be sure to follow her on Instagram at thekarinamethod.